Devarim, Deuteronomy 13. If there arise among you a prophet or a dreamer of dreams and gives you a sign or a wonder and the sign or wonder come to pass whereof he spoke unto you, saying, Let us go after other Elohim, which you have not known, and let us serve them. You shall not hearken unto the words of that prophet, or that dreamer of dreams. For Yahuwah, Elohechem, proves you to know whether ye love at Yahuwah, Elohechem, with all your heart and with all your soul. Ye shall walk after Yahuwah Elohechem and fear him and guard at his commandments and obey his voice and ye shall serve him and cleave unto him. And that prophet or that dreamer of dreams shall be put to death, because he has spoken to turn you away from Yahuwah Elohechem, which brought you out of the land of Mitzrayim, and redeemed you out of the house of bondage, to thrust you out of the way which Yahuwah Elohechem commanded you to walk in. So shall you put the evil away from the midst of you, If your brother, the son of your mother, or your son, or your daughter, or the woman of your bosom, or your friend, which is as your own soul, entice you secretly, saying, Let us go and serve other Elohim, which you have not known, you nor your fathers, namely of the Elohim of the people which are round about you, nigh unto you, or far off from you, from the one end of the earth, even unto the other end of the earth. You shall not consent unto him, nor hearken unto him, neither shall your eye pity him, neither shall you spare, neither shall you conceal him, but you shall surely kill him. Your hand shall be first upon him to put him to death, and afterwards the hand of all the people. And you shall stone him with stones that he die, because he has sought to thrust you away from Yahuwah Eloheka, which brought you out of the land of Mitzrayim, from the house of bondage. And all Yasharael shall hear and fear and shall do no more any such wickedness as this is among you. If you shall hear, say, in one of your cities, which Yahuwah Eloheka has given you to dwell there, saying, Certain men, the children of Belial, are gone out from among you, and have withdrawn at the inhabitants of their city, saying, Let us go, and serve other Elohim, which ye have not known. Then shall you inquire, and make search, and ask diligently. Behold, if it be truth, and the thing certain, that such abomination is wrought among you, you shall surely smite at the inhabitants of that city with the edge of the sword destroying it utterly, and at all that is therein, and at the cattle thereof, with the edge of the sword, and at you shall gather all the spoil of it into the midst of the street thereof, and shall burn with fire at the city, and at all the spoil thereof, every wit for Yahuwah Eloheka, and it shall be a heap forever. It shall not be built again. There shall cleave not of the cursed thing to your hand, that Yahuwah may turn from the fierceness of his anger 
and show you mercy and have compassion upon you and multiply you as he has sworn unto your fathers. When you shall hearken to the voice of Yahuwah Eloheka to guard at all his commandments which I command you this day to do that which is right in the eyes of Yahuwah Eloheka.